Hi guys, welcome back to the latest episode of Agents Live. Uh, today we've got a busy day because of the Melbourne lockdown that happened last week, so we had to push back a lot of open inspection and auction to this weekend. Uh, the market is heating up in general, but some units uh, and some smaller units are a, bit, a little bit tough, so we've got two of them today. So it will be good to see what's going to happen with these auctions, okay? So stay tuned and watch this Agents Live vlog this week, okay? My name is Odmin, and just like you, I love real estate. The difference between you and me is that I sell them for a living. There are a lot of things happening in the background of closing a deal, and I absolutely love it. It's more than what people see from the outside. That's why I decided to create a vlog called Agents Life that will show you the insights of what we do behind the curtain. So this house has got a, a home theater system, so I'm just gonna put this on so for people to be able to see and watch. So the complaint, to be honest with this house, is that it is a little bit dark, so I'm actually going to even make it more dark and by turning on the uh, home theater system. We've had uh, some quiet open inspections in the last few weeks. Last Thursday also, there were only like two groups uh, came, so the, I think the vendor is a little bit nervous, obviously. I can see that Ray White is also doing an open inspection at number 11. They always do that. Um, we're heading to our first auction for today, number 8 Southampton Drive. Um, as of yesterday, we've got about five confirmed bidders to come to the auction. It will be very interesting to see how many actually turn up. The owner has a high expectation for this one. Um, there was an auction uh, last week on the same street, number 28 Southampton, sold for 765. However, the owner of this property wanted something a little bit higher than that, ideally something with an eight in front, so 800. Uh, otherwise, they'll settle somewhere around the 785, 790. Eight on yep. who, who's here, so the hot buyers, so we got Melissa and Costa. So two of them are here. Gentleman who's never been here, who, who's been here before, but we've never thought that he, he will be a buyer. Like he always right. insists to make an offer private, on the private sale. Right. He's, he's here. And then he just asked me, uh, how do I register? So like, so he's gonna bid today. Great. So okay. we've been quoting it seven, 700 to 750. Yep. And last week, number 28, so this is number 8, number 28, mm -hmm. okay, uh, it was sold for 765. Mm -hmm. Number 21, across the road, uh, sold before Christmas for 775. Okay. okay. Is that right? 600. Yeah, what? start. Yeah, no worries. 600. 600. What is that bid there? Okay, 600. Before I place it. 600,000. 600,000, okay. Fair. Ordwin, in or out? 630. 630, sir. 630. That's 630,000 now. Let's go again. 650. Okay, at 650 now, we're going to We're not there yet, six, not even at the five, range. Oh. 670. 670. 670 straight back, we have minimum. At 670, we haven't even hit the bottom of the quote yeah, range yet. We haven't yet. hit the bottom of the range. Let's get it done. jump in, in or out, once. 690 straight back at $690,000 now. All will let's take 710. Please. At $690,000, Jordan, really appreciate that. Well done. 710. Following instructions. I'm following instructions. Still at 20. So 710. 710. 710. 710. Way in excess of this mark. Sorry. 710. 710. This is the opportunity where you should be jumping back in and showing your competition strength and showing that you certainly made business out here. 730. 30 it is. Nice to see you. Fresh mate. 7.30 with them. 7.50. Yeah. Let's go, sir. Let's not muck around. Not yet. Seven, after 7.50, we can take 10. At 7.3. 7.50. 50. Bang. Straight back. Good. Third. Final time. Not yet, sir. Not yet. But I can, I can try 10. Uh, try 10. 10. 7.60. Okay, 10. Okay. 7.60. Okay. 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 Not yet, 780. No, not, not yet. But 780, I'm going to check with the vendor. But at 775, they, they'll, they'll tell me now. Real estate journey starts all over again. The motions and the stress of finding the perfect property. This is the one you've been longing for. 780. 80, bang. Right, it's irrelevant that now it's still going to push 790 for you. But if we get the five, just run in, yeah. get the confirmation. And then put on if we have to. It's with their family. Uh, because of, uh, the Seven, 780 at the moment, it's with their family, yeah. but it's not on the market. Yeah. It will be passed into the, to that family. Yeah. But if you bid 790, it will be on the market. Yeah. Are we in or out? 
It, it, it crossed my mind yeah. to place a Venlo bit like 785 and we'll try for, for Costa to come at 790 but I just feel like they're too smart to play that he's, game. He's getting, yeah. he's getting he, frustrated. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah okay. I've, I've got a feeling I could get a little bit more out of them if, I, if, if we pass it in. But okay. it could be like 785. Okay. Yeah? So yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll pass it in. Yeah? Yeah, all right. We'll do that. Yeah. Yep. That's fine. I, I support that decision. This is also to wrap it up for you. As much as to wrap it up for them, wrap it up for you. But everybody needs to come to the table now. Remember, if you come back with and say to me, seven, it's, that we're going to walk out. All right. 785 and that. 785 and that. 785, 90 day settlement. 90 day settlement. All right. So, auction number one done. Uh, congratulations to Rob and Gina. I know you'll be watching this as well sold for 785 sometimes uh, we had to pass property in if we knew that we could potentially get more so i got a sense that the buyer would pay more so i made that you know executive decisions to pass it in rather than pushing the vendor to put on the market now we're heading to a really really tough auction uh, at uh, 29 to 31 tulum road in Carnegie. we've uh, pretty much got no buyer uh, we had one buyer that had bought something last night so he texted us and he said that he had bought so he's not gonna uh, be at our auction today uh, but we're hoping given that the market is not a bad market that there will be somebody there that could you know potentially just walk up for the first time and bid so we've arrived unit 3 29 to 31 Tulumbu Road this is Sean his second auction and he's gonna get passion again <laughs> In terms of the buyers, Justin had bought a property, so he texted us last night yeah, that he's not going to be here. In saying so, there are a couple of buyers who I think could be potentially be bidding. So the scenario will be pretty similar to what we've discussed and I've just shared it to Ben as well. I think 520 has to be our vendor bid and, uh, and then we have to invite somebody to place a bid above 520. Uh, that will be 530. If we can get something else above that, a genuine like a real bit that would be better without placing a vendor bit. Obviously, we want to get a reserve price from you. Yeah. yeah. What, 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 what are you thinking? 550. Yeah. Yeah. I think. How about 500,000? I would have thought that would be a fair start. That would be a reasonable start. Would anybody like to take it up at that figure? Price? Anyone? 500,000? Yeah. So, that's five, they've, they've got the bid. Yeah. 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 At 520, it's back with me or anybody else in the crowd for that matter. I just want to move us along in a slightly northerly direction, get us to where we need to be. But at 520, it's back with me, sir. Is there anyone no. now, though? There's Don't do that. If you're waiting for this to pass in, in, the vendor will go up again to potentially above the quoting price. 540 will make you in a really, really good position to buy. That's on the body language we've got from people in the crowd. You've probably seen it yourself. He really feels like the one. Mm. Doubt he will come to 525, but we'll see. Just from what he's telling me. Mm. Okay. Any changes to the reserve if we do get a roll of hands or oh, no, just leave it? Yeah, that's you fair. Another bit. Yeah, I think so. 530, you're, gonna, you're not going to buy it yet, but we will put them in a position that they have to make a decision. Okay. If you are the highest bidder here today, 530. you will okay. buy the home. 530. 530. 530. There it is. It's right. straight back in at 530 here. On the left, sir. You shouldn't be thinking twice for two bedroom unit in Carnegie, guys. 35. Not yet. 40. 540. Can we do 35? Not yet. Not yet. <clears throat> Not yet. 40. Sir, I make a promise. At 530, if you bid 40, I will not sell it to you. But it will put you in the box seat to hear the reserve. 530, 40? 40. 540. 40. 40. Got it there. <laughs> the ball is in your court. Really? <laughs> <coughs> no, that's okay. No, I understand. Yeah. No, no, not trying to put pressure on. Back in front yeah. position at 540. But we are potentially a bit away from being on the market. Love to see it third yes. 550. Yeah. Job done. You, you're not looking anymore. The great news is. <coughs> okay, 550. Okay, 550. 550. 550. We are selling. Selling? Selling. At 550, selling. Playing for keeps. At 550. You sure? Absolutely sure. The Taylor win real estate. I must say, we're selling then. Selling. So, congratulations. Well, big boss. What an auction that one was. Is it a lips? Nope. Uh, uh, 
So we knew we came into the auction with, with, with no buyer whatsoever, but we've got two buyers bit right, right there and then. That's what happened when the market is hot. Everybody wants a piece of a real estate. This is supposed to be a good one. Though. So this is supposed to be like a guarantee sales. So, but we hope that it will, it will, it will become that. Sometimes when you are overly confident, you know, it could backfire a little bit as well. So the two auctions today were really, really tough. It's like a 50-50, uh, but we managed to pull it through and we hope this one, given the strong feedback. Mark is somebody that I, that I can describe as a committed vendor. When I asked him for a reserve, he said, I don't care. So I uh, we look it's been quoted 780 to 830. I've suggested Mark about 850. Mark's point is he's here to sell. 999 and 900. A million. A million will give you a big clap. I've asked the whole way. Come on, a hundred dollars. Alright, one million! On the next episode of Agents Life. Our goal is to get a mil. Yeah. That would be fantastic. All right. Our goal is to get as much as we can. Thank you. Now, but at 880, 890. Thank you, sir. 890. Thank you, sir. Back in. You can't leave now. Really, really. You really. just can't. Only at small change at this level. <laughs> Are you out? What did you say? What did you say? Are you out or not? Four, three, five. Yeah. We're asking for five. Is it a market? Or no, not yet. yet. We're asking for four, three, five. Yeah. All right. We're going to formally pass the 